Hi guys, it's Theo here and today we're taking a trip to the Cambridge University Library because I've got to borrow a book from there, a primary source for my essay on natural law, which is due by next week. And I'll also get some work done for a few hours right there in the university library. And I'll show you around and uh, show you how I'm searching for the book and how it looks inside. It's, it's massive, I'm telling you. So uh, let's go. Now how I'm searching for the book is on this platform I discover and I just search for the book title. So it's this one, The New Science of Giambattista Vico, um, edited by Bergen and Fish, Cornell University Press, 1984, available at the University Library, South Wing, 5 follow signs to South Staircase, 5th floor, and that's the number that we need. So we'll take a screenshot of that all right and um, yeah you, you can see by the indications how big this library is so let's go and get the book now and get to work what I'm packing for my trip to the library is my laptop in here some printed materials chargers my pencil case over there add some markers in there and very important a water bottle and um, that's it. The only problem is that I don't know where I put my transparent bag and I'm not allowed to take stuff in non-transparent bags in there. So I'll probably have to buy one when I go in now. So this is how the library looks like from the front. I entered the library and look for the south wing where my book is supposed to be and the south staircase is this one that I'm uh, walking up right now. Uh, fifth floor and that's the transparent bag I was talking to you about. So this is the view from the fifth floor south wing fifth floor window. So the code of our book is in the 200 range. So this is the door that I have to enter through. It starts with uh, academic journals and then there's a long corridor. I went almost to the end of it and uh, found the shelf that I needed. This is how you uh, turn on the light. Quite interestingly, you can set how many minutes you want it to be on. And this is the book. I found it and it feels so good to to feel a, an old book in your hands. And then I worked for about an hour without a break. took a short break, stood up and stretched for a little bit, then got uh, back to work again for another hour. Then I decided to go back downstairs because I was getting hungry. I went to the tea room. I don't have any footage from the tea room, but I had some sandwiches there. And then uh, I went to the great reading room, which you can see here, and worked there for about two more hours.
this is me at about 6 p.m. exiting the library and it's really nice to see this building in the evening light. So this has been my trip to the university library. Thanks a lot for watching and I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Also, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell button to be notified every time I post a new video. I'll see you in my next one. Bye!